welcome back to my channel. I'm here to bring you a super, what I think is a cool video today, and it is a collab with my friend Carol from The Blush and Brunette, and you can see it right here, and I'll post it somewhere here, and also, you can click on her link down below. We are doing our current hair care products. I am doing for my hair, which is oily hair, and she has dry hair. So all the products that I use will orient around my kind of hair, and then you know she has hair products that are geared toward dry hair. So anyway, you should go and click on her channel. She is sweet, she is knowledgeable, I love listening to her. She has an amazing voice, and I just think she has great videos. And um, I think that if you aren't subscribed to her, you should jump over to her channel because she is just such an amazing person. She's a dear friend, and I'm definitely so blessed that she is in my life. So anyway, with that being said, go click on Carol's link when you're finished watching mine. I'm going to start off in the products like basically from washing my hair to drying it and then the tools that I use to give it the look that I'm going for. So we're just going to start off like that. So when I'm washing my hair, what I'm currently using are these two products right here. This is the Moroccan Argan Oil Conditioner and this is the generic um, CVS Argan Oil sh Shampoo. Now. I bought the generic conditioner and it was basically water, so I took it back. This stuff is good though. It has a thick consistency. I feel like it is moisturizing. Um, and then this obviously goes with it and is very thick and moisturizing as well. I'm all about moisturizing even though I do have a tendency to have oily hair about second or third day. I still believe that in the summertime and I use a lot of heat products, I need to make sure my hair is very moisturized. So I don't have anything extraordinary about these products. I got both of them at CVS. They are both about $7, so this is my first um, time using either of these products, but I like Argan Oil, so I'm always down with that. Following up with that, I have been always using after the shower is the Numi Argonics Argon Oil, and I love this stuff. I use it, and I use it like on the ends, and I put a little bit in my hands, I rub it together, and I just kind of rub it down. I don't get too close to my scalp because I am an oily haired kind of person, but I love this stuff. It makes my hair so soft. It smells so good. And this bottle right here is empty, but I have had this for all, I think about a year. Like it just ran out because you really only need a dime sized amount. So I love this stuff. I've tried other argan oils and I don't love them as much. So. If you are looking for an argan oil, you need to pick up the Numi one. You just just take my word for it that you're gonna love it. I promise. So, okay. And after that, I spray in the Numi leave-in conditioner, and this says instant, instantly healthy and strong hair. Now, what's funny is I bought this, and I meant to buy something else. Um, I can't even remember what it was because I've had this for a while. But I love this stuff. I spray it in like that smells good and then I kind of let it sit for a second and then I, I I comb it through I comb it through also I towel dry my hair so before I do the argan oil or the leave-in conditioner I towel dry my hair and then I let it I like to let it air dry I don't really like to blow dry it but if I am gonna blow dry it I'm gonna go with this blow dryer right here and it's the new me one and it has three speeds and let me tell you this will blow your face off like whoo it also has three different settings and it has the little cooling button right here. So this is an amazing blow dryer. This is the Numi, oh I don't know what they officially call it. I don't remember, but I will insert the official name here. I just can't remember off the top of my head and I apologize for that. When I am using heat products on my hair, I will always use a heat spray. This is the Tresemme Thermal Creations heat tamer leave-in spray and I feel like it's a bit thick so I only spray like try to spray just like the bottoms from pretty far away I don't like to spray it really close because I feel like it'll make my hair get oilier faster so um, I do use this my friend Stephanie and Jen from Jen Loves Reviews and Stephanie from Little Lady Lori they both use this so I decided to pick this up and I'm you got to protect your hair you just you can't use a heat product without using some sort of heat protecting spray on the days that my hair uh, like second or third day hair I will use this dry shampoo and it's the John Frieda Luxurious Volume Dry Shampoo Anytime Volume Refresher and it looks like this 
And you can get this at CVS and I just use it underneath at my roots and I let it sit there for about, mm, I don't know, five to ten minutes and then I brush it through. And I feel like it does an okay job. I'm not sure it does the best job. I really want to try the pss, dry shampoo for brown hair, but I, I don't know, or the Batiste. I've heard really good things about those, but I'm still working on this one. And actually Stephanie from Little Lady Lord got this for me, so I like it. I have no complaints about it. For hairsprays, I use the Elnet Satin from L'Oreal Extra Stronghold. This is a $15 one, I think. But um, all the hair stylists um, on movie sets, TVs, photo shoots swear by this. It holds your hair without leaving it crunchy. And you can do stuff with it and brush it and it will still hold your hair. Now when I'm getting my big volume hair, I use the Not Your Mother, She's the Tease voluminizing hairspray and I just did a video in my Friday favorites last week where I talked about this and where I heard about it so I'll link that below and I really like this stuff I got this at CVS as well and I also just like the packaging like it's totally cute anyway it's called she's a tease because you tease your hair and then you well you spray your hair and then you tease it is what I do but and then lastly for products I also take biotin this is biotin 5000 milligram I think MCG, is that milligram? I don't know. It says skin, hair, nail support. Now, the only thing about biotin, in my opinion, is it takes about six months to really see a noticeable difference. Now, I have thin hair. I didn't always have thin hair, but over the years, I've had some extensions that I felt have thinned my hair out. The um, tape-in kind and the keratin bonded kind, I actually felt I had really thick hair and I felt like those two extensions actually thinned my hair out a lot. So um, over on this side of my hair, I feel like my hair, actually like right here, my hair is thinning. And I don't mean thinning like old lady thinning. I mean like, I just feel like it's not as full as it used to be. When I pull my hair back into ponytail, I feel like you can see my scalp. I don't like that. So I've been taking biotin. I don't notice a difference yet, but I know that people swear by it, so I figure it can't hurt. Now, for the tools that I use, I want to put a disclaimer out there, they're all new me. So um, that's just what I use. It's the brand that I like, and it's the brand that I trust, and it's the brand that I feel like does the best job. So let's go into what I use for products to style my hair. First off is my Numi Reverse Curling Wand. This is just the standard, I don't know, I guess it's plastic or whatever this is, ceramic. And it's the one that is skinnier here and longer here. And I use this to get different types of waves. It only has one heat setting, so you don't really know. I think it's 400, but I'm not, 400 Fahrenheit, 200 Celsius, I think is how hot this gets. But I'm not really positive, and you know, that kind of sucks that it doesn't say that, but other ones do. The straightener I'm using the new me mega star and it looks like this and it's brand new and it has <laughs> and it has this lights up right here it tells you how hot it is and then inside right here this is the on button and this is the hotter and cooler section so you can see how hot your straightener is. Anyway, why I love this, this is their new one, I tried their old ones, and this, I tried the Silhouette, that's what I used to have, it's what I still have back there, but I use this only. If you're interested in, um, maybe like a blog sale, I was thinking about having one because I don't use that straightener, and I also have another, um, 32mm curling wand, if you're interested in that, comment below in a blog sale, and maybe I will put them up at a really discounted price. Okay, so the Megastar. Love the Megastar. It's so fast. It smooths your hair. I feel like it doesn't really hold on to it and leave it crunchy, you know what I mean? It just, you just go like this and your hair is instantly straight. It's amazing. Like, it cuts your straightening in half by 75%. No joke, it'll take five minutes to do your whole head. It's amazing. Like, I love this. I can't rave enough about it, and you should go to Numi Style or NumiProducts.com, whatever it is, I'll link it below. I think it's sold out, but uh, there, it'll be back, don't worry. It'll. This is brand new, so it'll be back. Lastly, to curl my hair, what I've really been using the most is my Numi Titan 3 wand. And it looks like this, the three in one. And it has this little this little spot right here tells you how hot it is, the up and down, the on and off switch, and then this right here, I actually just used it, it's pretty hot. This is how you pull it off with this little button right here, and it just goes on top of there like that. Now it's called the three in one because it comes in other sizes. This is the 32, this is the biggest one. This is the smallest one at the 19 millimeter. And then the middle one, which gives you middle 
beautiful waves and curls is the 25 millimeter right here. Now this will give you tight curls and this gives you loose waves like what I have today. So it gives you the three. They're made of titanium. I feel like they are sturdy. I've had zero problems ever with them. Um, and I just really love it. Now I use this thing right here when I have hot products like this. You can't tell but this is really still hot. So I put it in here and I don't know what this thing is made of. Neoprene or something. My mom put any hot things in here. It's called hot iron holster. I guess you could Google it. And this you put on the edge and it'll just sit there like, like that on the edge of anything. So I love that. You can put that, throw that in your suitcase. So I curl my hair, I gotta go, put that in there. It's not gonna burn anything or melt anything. So definitely love that. My current hair care products, I do hope that you go and check out Carol's video. I am linking that down below. She's such an amazing person. You just really need to check her video out. You will love it. Her voice is so calming. I just love to listen to her. Anyway, um, it, what do you use? Link down below if you use something different. Do you have oily hair or do you have dry hair? I'm always curious because everybody's different. So I hope you all enjoyed my current hair care video. And, and if you have questions or comments or anything, please leave it down below as well. And I would be happy to answer them for you. Thank you so much for watching. And I will see you guys in my next video. It's almost my birthday. Woohoo!